Hey guys, it's me Tokraft, and today I'm driving the Tiger 2. But why the Tiger 2? That's what we are going to discover in this video. Well guys, the Tiger 2 is actually a German tier 8 heavy tank. It's pretty popular because a lot of it has great armor, great mobility and a great gun. And the armor on the hull is 150 millimeters on the front, 80, 80 on the side and rear. The bad turret which is mounted on the Tiger 2 right now has only a 100 on the front and 80 on the sides and 80 on the rear. But I have mounted the better turret for the Tiger 2 already. It's standing in my garage but this is an older replay so that's why the old turret is mounted right here. But the old turret has only 100 on the front and 80 on the sides. So that is not quite good for this turret. But I did manage to get a good game in this tank. As you can see right here, I'm playing in a platoon with one of my favorite uh, friends to play with, Yogurt Boy. He's driving his Carnivon, Carnarvon, and I'm driving my Tiger 2. And we are just looking around. As you can see. We're trying to, to find some opportunities to shoot enemies. We can see there's an AMX 12 ton on our left. Scout tank, I'm, try I'm aiming for him and as you can see I can make a quite good shot on him. And I managed to penetrate the AMX right in the front. And of course he goes away. Yogurt with its, with its carnival is closing in but I don't trust it and I'm staying back a bit. And we just spotted another tank. What kind of tank? It's a KV-3. And I'm closing in as well. And there's a T-32 on the other side of the rail. But unfortunately I don't pay any attention on him. And there's a lot of... There's two enemies spotted on the right of us. An IS and a T-32. T-32 is a tier 8 American premium tank, really powerful gun, we really have to look out for that guy. So that's why I'm turning my attention that way. And I managed to penetrate the IS. And I'm going back. Try to afford shots from the hill. And also an, H an ARL is driving uphill. And the IS just got taken out. And Yogurt unfortunately didn't have a quite great battle because he only has 121 healths left. So that's probably going to be a loss in the game. Oh, and I managed to get a great hit in that HRL. As you can see, this is the gun which I've mounted right now. The second gun in the Tiger 2. This gun has 225 millimeters of penetration and 320 alpha damage. Enemy armor is destroyed. And I just killed the... Yeah, one of the tanks over there. I forgot. I didn't saw which tank I killed. Doesn't matter. Only the T-32 is left on that hill over there. Let me see, this gun, which I've mounted right now, has a great aiming time of 2.5 seconds and has an accuracy of 0.36 at 100 meters. And I didn't manage to penetrate the T-32 there. But this concludes that the Tiger 2 is a really powerful tank. In my opinion, it's pretty much more a defender tank than an attacking tank. That's why it has great armor and a good gun. There's a T-29 on my left, so I'm aiming for him. And I don't have a shot on him, so I'm turning my attention back to the hill. Because it's a really dangerous place for the enemies to snipe us. Oh, and Joker just got taken out.
and it looks like we were going to lose that game. So I thought I should stop the cap. And the T32 is still uphill, so I also had to pay attention on him. Unfortunately, I didn't penetrate him. So, I thought, let's stop the cap. That's one of the most important things to defend. Oh, and a T-32 is almost dead. And he's dead now. So, my intention... I don't have to pay attention anymore to the hill. And I saw there was a Black Prince behind me. So, I'm aiming for the Black Prince. And unfortunately, that one misses. Aiming again, reloading. And then... He gets in scouted. And then I turn my attention to the Indian Panzer. And I penetrate and I shoot him to his side. Trying to find some cover there. Using the houses and <laughs> the dead body of Yogurt. And there's a super Persian coming in as well. And now the action is coming to going to start. There's a KV-1S, Super Persian. And then I'm also aiming for him. But then at that point I saw there was a 28 prototype in front of me. Oh, and there's the first shot of the Tiger which penetrated. Because the side armor of the Tiger 2 is not quite good. That means it's not the greatest side scrape tank. And I managed to penetrate the KV-1S. And I'm driving through houses. That's pretty weird. That house has to be destroyed. I don't know what's happening right there. But we're searching for the 28th prototype in the Tiger. But at that point I can see there's a VK Tiger, no no not a VK, Tiger P on the top of the hill. And there's the 28th prototype, T28 prototype. The Super Persian is trying to shoot him down as well. And I got shot by another Super Persian in the side. But I'm aiming for the Super Persian, I thought that guy has to, has to be dead first. But the 28 prototype has great armor on the front, so I'm again aiming for him. Aiming for the lower plate, I think. I tracked him, unfortunately. Fortunately, he penetrates me first. And the Tiger P again. But at that point, I aim for the lower plate. And I did manage to penetrate him and take him out. There's the Tiger 1 and there's the v Tiger P. On top of the hill. Okay. Tiger is one shot now for me. So I thought the Tiger P the Tiger has to be taken out first. Because that's again one gun less shooting at me, of course. It's always handy. And now the Tiger P is also one shot, I think. But unfortunately I missed that shell. I missed it. And the Super Persian managed to penetrate me again. There's only those two enemies. Oh, and there's the Tiger. And the Tiger P got taken out by me as well. Four kills. A lot of damage. So now I pointed my attention towards the Super Persian. But I had really low health. So I had to think. What to do? I thought let the soup the other super Persian of my team go first because he has more health left than me. And I can back him up when he is attacking the super Persian. Trying to fight my way there. And there's the super Persian. So now he is scouted and the other super Persian shot him. So I know at that point he's a one shot kill as well. So I just was going for it. 
I thought that Super Persian had to be killed so the cap didn't matter anymore. And I got out of the cap. I'm just going for the Super Persian, but I and I know his back was turned to me, so I just could go for it. And I took him out as well. Five kills. It's not bad at all. I hope you enjoyed the video about the Tiger 2. As you can see right here, I've mounted the best turret, and the gun is the same as in the replay, but the gun looks different when you um, have mounted the new turret, as you can see. The accuracy is a lot better than it was before, so I really do love the Tiger 2. But right now I am busy with my Carnivon Carnarvon to actually collect the, uh, the Conqueror, as you can see right here. But I have to manage a lot of money still, and that's gonna be hard. But I'll see you guys next time. Hope you liked it. See ya.